Fitz from North Edmonton Chiropractic Clinic, and I'm here with a patient, Amandeep, who has an interesting story. I don't usually uh, treat jaws, but she had a jaw problem, and I'm going to ask her a few questions. Uh, Amandeep, how are you today? I'm good, thank you. So you had jaw pain for how long? More than a year. Yeah? Yes. Uh, almost two. It happened in June of 2021 or something like that? Yes. So what happened to your, your jaw? Uh, I, I pull out my wisdom tooth and then uh, I feel like terrible pain, very hard to chew, very hard to open my mouth and now all gone. All right, so it, it, you had trouble for two years with that? Yes. Like this is 2024, almost June now, so it's almost two years. Two years, yes. Two years, and, and so you couldn't eat uh, hard food? Yes. And, and your pain, every time you ate, it hurt? Yes. Yeah. And so you struggled, and your friend said to come here. Is that what happened? Yes, my one of my friends. She she told me to see you. Yeah. But you didn't know whether I treated jaws or no, not. No, I don't know. You just thought you'd try. Yes. There you go. Anyway, chiropractic does every joint in the body, uh, elbows, knees, shoulders, and uh, sometimes we even have to do a jaw adjustment um, because the dental extraction was putting too much pressure on a small little joint called the TMJ right in here. And there's clicking, popping, pain, and sometimes ringing in the ears. This also happens quite often after whiplash because of the trauma, the forces, the jaw is either pushed sideways or frontwards, backwards from uh, uh, head trauma. And the jaw gets stretched and people get TMJ. And so anyway, this was a success story after less than 10 treatments. She's out eating hard food now and uh, can't believe the difference. And I'm just recommending if you have a jaw problem, go see a chiropractor near you, somewhere in your city. But if you're in Edmonton, an area, North Edmonton, chiropractic, it's Dr. Fitz. Have a great day. Bye now.